Hello everybody and welcome to a new video. Today I'm going to be going over how to export your game and set up the itch.io page because that is the only thing I have ever used. And because Steam costs money and I ain't paying that for this game because it's just a tutorial. Anyways, uh, let's dive in. There we go. All right. So I've already play tested it. So all I'm going to want to do is go to file deployment. Um, I'm having it set for Windows. You can do this multiple times to get all the different other versions you want. Um, don't don't use the encryption here. It sucks. Don't do it. All right. Uh, I was just selecting the folder location. Um, here, if you have a bunch of custom content and especially if you're parallax mapping, no no it'll remove um sometimes it'll get buggy and remove pictures and stuff just if you're really concerned about your file size go through and delete things you're not using manually at least with i've never tried it with an mz but at least with mv it was broke so i've just never used it so i just enjoy this uh yeah so this export This is a really small game, so that was really fast. All right. Dis distribution package is complete. All right, so let's pull that up. We have the game. Let's just open it up to show. Am I standing up? Oh, look, it's the game. Okay. So right now you notice this, and it's completely... All right. So that's just... uh Because I'm uh releasing this with all the files in it, uh with access to everything go in effects are there pictures are here etc i can even go into the pictures folder hold on pictures are here and everything uh i'm just going to um that's the word compress it which you have to do in order to get it on the itch.io itch page, which I might have been okay with this one, but because uh, it's so teeny tiny, but with an actual full-length game, you're going to need to zip it. Um, with Windows, am I on Windows 11 or Windows 10? I don't know. With either of those, doesn't matter. Um, you can zip it. Pocket, put it in your pocket. And you'll notice the original is still here. So let me show you what happens actually when you, since this like, do this and encrypt. Um, yeah. We can overwrite it because I zipped it. Okay, it's done. Let's pull it back up. And now, you notice when we go in, nothing happened, right? Okay. Huh. Yeah. I don't know, man. I really don't know. Anyways, uh, don't use it. <laughs> Case in point, don't use it. I'm gonna actually deploy this again. Yeah, see, I had this hit. Hold on, something's not right. Because I had this. Okay. I realize now what happened. I just save it to my desktop. It was overriding the one that was already there, so it screwed up. But now, when I go in, yeah, you'll see everything's encrypted. It's not accessible without... Uh, yeah, you can't access it. Which, for the, for the purposes of this game, works fine. Anyways, actually, I need to compress that again. Okay, now, remember class, you're using the one from the desktop. Okay. 
Now let's open itch. All right, now that we have itch open, I'm just on my home page. Uh, but I want to I forget how to do this. Uh, my library. No, that's not it. Dashboard. Oh my goodness, here we go. Upload a new project right here. All right, so this is just going to be our maker. Z tutorial. How did I manage that? Oh, there we go. Um, I don't care. Ah, uh, okay. The title, title of your name, project URL. But it'll be up here when you're on the project. A uh, short description or tagline. Uh, this will be when you hover over it, it'll be what happens. A small tu tutorial. Oh my goodness. Not type today on RPG Maker and it's game downloadable released. Why? What? I don't know why that's like that. That shouldn't be like that. Desktop tutorial. Okay. That what I wanted? It's the one that did that. I don't know why it's being so buggy right now. Okay, it's uploading. Uh, this is stuff I'm gonna come back and do in a second. So we'll, uh, I'll be back with that finishes uploading and see if I can get what is happening on this page fixed because that is really weird. <laughs> All right, it has finished uploading. So this is for Windows. So just going to select that and then save and view page. Wow, the most basic version you can get of it. Um, I just did this to see if I go back in, if it will fix itself. It will not. All right, fair enough. I don't know what's going on with itch right now. And why these are dot dot dots, but we're just going to ignore that for now. Um, so let's add in. Let's see, tutorial. We're just going to do a basic title. Without any words, because we're basic like that. Um, description. I'm a... A... a YouTube series on how to make a basic theme in... Maker and see. Go check. This is the result. Go check it out if you're curious or stuck. Actually, oh. okay, link, insert link, part series, then link in your tab. That's just how it be. That's uh, just how it be. All right. And then let's actually backspace that once or twice. All right. Then I want to do a heading. Format. Heading. A basic, basic tutorial. I don't know how. Keep spelling that wrong.
I have a YouTube tube. I have a YouTube. Um, check me out if you need idea help slash ideas slash inspiration for your you make your tapes. Okay. I'm just kind of doing this to show you. Um, just for fun, the show bold YouTube. Um, and that's underlined. No, italicize that. Italicize that. Okay. So yeah, you see, you can do a lot of fun stuff with the text box. A uh, genre, tutorial, other, sure. All right, tags, RPG maker. Tutorial. Basic. Okay, yeah, sure. RPG Maker and the in tutorial. No, this project does not contain AI. None of those. Yep, game. Tutorial. Oh my gosh, how come I keep spelling this wrong consistently? I don't know. And, uh, X. Correct. Zip, and you should be good to go. All right, save this in the view page. View page. Oh, look, there's this now. There's words, uh, but you know, you'll notice it's kind of boring. It's just gray and white and black and red. So let's fix that. All right. Um, let's see, for the background, that's... I could immediately go to downloads. Um... I don't even need to get this from tutorial, I have this like on everyone. Uh, 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 let's see, I want a continuous one, so let's see. It's... But that doesn't really fit my theme, does it? Mm, let's try force. I feel like that fits it better. I meant to do this one as forest. Oops. Let's try that again. There we go. Forest. That fits the thing. All right. Now let's see. Um, that is impossible to read. I. This is. I like this one. Um, you can also use the font in your game in here to make it easier. All right, so I want my headers to be a nice forest screen. Okay. Uh, buttons. Make them a sky blue. And then links. Let's also make them blue because they're also clickable. All right. Uh, background 2, I believe, is the one I want. Yes, it is. You can make it a nice cream color. But then that makes the blue kind of hard to see, so let's just that. There we go. And now, try save. We have a itch page set up. <clears throat> um, yeah. This is it. Um, I don't really have anything else to add. Oh yeah, I actually forgot. Um, want to make sure that you release the game instead of just having. See, it says published appear instead of draft. 
So yeah, that's about it. I hope you all enjoyed the video, found it useful, etc, etc. And I hope to see you in the next video. Bye!